Do you know the different types of data analytics? If not, let's start. The first type is descriptive analytics. It tells you what happened in the past, but it doesn't tell you why it happened. We use descriptive analytics when we are looking for patterns of past data behavior. Things like data aggregation, data mining, and data visualization play a big role here. To understand this in an easier way, imagine that you are a doctor and have a sick patient. In this stage, you collect relevant information about her weight, height, diet, chronic sickness, medical history, etc. The second type is diagnostic analytics, and it answers the question, why did it happen, by using past data collected in the descriptive stage. To develop this stage, analysts use techniques such as drill down, data discovery, data mining, and correlations. In our patient example, after revising all of our descriptive data, we notice that she has many cavities and low energy levels. We infer that this might be due to her diet that consists only of cake and soda. Another type is predictive analytics. And here you use data to forecast the probability of the occurrence of future scenarios. Here we would use techniques such as regression analysis, forecasting, pattern matching, and predictive modeling. Going back to our previous example, we can forecast that if our patient continues with her unhealthy lifestyle, in the long run, she will develop diabetes and high blood pressure. However, we cannot say for sure that this will happen since no one can predict the future. And the last type is prescriptive analytics. They give us insights on how to improve or fix the current status. This type of analytics is characterized by graph analysis, simulation, complex event processing, neural networks, recommendation engines, heuristics, and machine learning. And to help our patient, we decide to change her diet and redirect her to the dentist. Remember that the effectivity of this stage relies on the quality of the previous types of analytics. In conclusion, there are four different types of analytics that work together to draw insights and create value. In my opinion, there is no type more important than the other. And even though they seem to work in a certain order, in real life scenarios, people can start and jump directly to a different stage. It all depends on the needs and priorities of your client. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please press the like button and share it with your friends. Also, if you would like to support me, you can do it so by buying me a coffee. Don't forget to follow me on my new Twitch channel, where we will be playing horror games together. See you later! Bye!